So sometimes when I feel overwhelmed and stressed, I have episodes of anxiety. And I'm sure some of you know what anxiety feels like. It's a very paralyzing feeling where you can't do anything. It's like you're frozen at that time. And it's very difficult to deal with anxiety, especially maybe you're at work. You know, sometimes at work, you may have a deadline or it's chaotic. There's a lot of pressure. There's a lot of stress at work. And all of a sudden you overcome with this anxiety feeling. And so what do you do at work? Do you just walk out of your job? You know, if you do that often enough, walking out of your job, you may not be employed for very long. And so I tried different tools and practices to help me deal with anxiety. And the best tools that I found to help deal with anxiety, especially in an emergency situation, like when you're at work and you have anxiety, that's an emergency situation. The best tools that I found is to just deal with the breath, to focus on the breath. And there are two breaths especially that I feel that really helps me to start to slow down the brain wave and to help me return back to my daily life. So the first breathing technique is to take your thumb finger and your index finger and place it above your nose nostrils. And then you're going to use your thumb to close one of your nostrils and then you're gonna breathe in through the other nostril. And then you're gonna take your index finger and close the other nostril and you're gonna breathe out of the other nostril. And you're just gonna keep rotating it back and forth. So it's And I'm telling you, if you just do this exercise and focus on your breath in that way, in like two minutes, your brainwave actually starts to slow down a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. So if you're at work, you know, you may only have to take like five minute break or 10 minute break and do this little exercise. And then you can also, you know, take a break in between the rotation. So you could go, and then take a break, you know, maybe a 10 second break and then go back to doing it. So do it the way it feels best for you in order to really slow down the brainwave and help alleviate your anxiety. So the second technique involves your tongue. So what you're going to do is take your tongue and roll it up to the roof of your mouth like this. Roll your tongue to the roof of your mouth and hold it there. And while you're holding it there, you're going to breathe in for four seconds and then you're going to hold your breath for seven seconds and then you're going to breathe out for eight seconds. So it looks something like this. So the initial reason why I started to practice this breathing technique is because this breath is actually good for the digestive system. And because one of my major health issues has always been with my digestion, I started practicing this breath. Like when I'm in my office or when I'm walking my dog, I would do this four, seven, eight breath initially because of my digestion, 
But then I discovered that this breath was so great to help me alleviate my anxiety. So next time you have an episode of anxiety, try one of these breathing techniques or try both and let me know what you think. Leave a comment below. And if you have your own breathing technique to help alleviate your anxiety, please share it because your comments, feedback, and suggestions really help me and my community at large. And if you like this video, please make sure to share it and subscribe to my channel. And if you want to visit all of my spiritual and holistic living tips, just go to my website at yinandyangliving.com. Kumapsinida.